We are pausing new ChatGPT Plus signups for a bit. The search and usage post Dev Day has exceeded our capacity, and we want to make sure everyone has a great experience. You can still sign up to be notified within the app when subs reopen. And that's just a few days after they released their new features. GPT Turbo is cool, and it's amazing to finally have DALI 3, GPT Vision, and the PDF plugin in one chat window. But this huge search and plus subscriptions can only be due to the new GPT feature. This new create your own GPT feature is absolutely incredible in my opinion and a true game changer. So let's have a look at it. When you have ChatGPT Plus, you can click here on Explore. And then here you can see the different GPTs. Down here are GPTs created by OpenAI. You can scroll through them and test them. And then here you can create your own GPT. Now I created the Toxic Relationship Guide. This is for my coaching. I gave it my own information to help people through toxic relationships. Now here I can use it. Um, I didn't actually want to do that. Let me go back. I want to click here on Edit. So when you edit, you can see how you, you can create your GPT. It's a GPT builder where you just can create the GPT through normal nat natural language that you type in down here. Then here's this Configure tab. Uh, and here's everything that we um, configured. And here you can put in your own knowledge base which then the GPT refers to. So general healing advice from toxic relationships, then a lot about codependency and trauma bonding, my general specific knowledge to make sure the people get um, exactly what, what they need and what I teach and help them with. So in my opinion, this is absolutely amazing, a fantastic game changer and the opportunities and possibilities with this are, I don't know, endless, it's, it's amazing. Now they plan to bring out a GPT store in November, but with Plus shutting down and with the huge restrictions ChatGPT4 has at the moment where you can really just put in a few prompts and then you need to wait. I am really not so sure about this. GPT creators will become a revenue share if their GPT gets used a lot. But for that, to make it valuable or worth it, you probably need a big user base. And with Plus shutting down, I really don't see that happening at the moment. They are really limiting themselves. Unless they make the GPT store available for everyone. So not just for plus users, but for every user, they can go into the store and see if there's a specific GPT that they want and then just subscribe to that. I haven't heard or read anything about this, but in my opinion, opening a GPT store to everyone is probably a smart move to get the best exposure and the most traffic possible. Maybe it works somehow like they can test a GPT with two to three prompts and then buy it or subscribe to it or pay only for the usage that they actually do? I am not sure about this, but for me it sounds like it would be a good idea. What, what do you think about that? You think a GPT store open for everyone would make sense? Aside from that, I made a video how you can create your own GPT. Very easy and beginner friendly. Plus, a few ideas that have, in my opinion, very great potential. You can watch it right over there.